Um, we'll move on to our 6.4, uh, which is a presentation of proclamation des designating the month of September 2022 as National Recovery Month in Lake County. And I'll come and read this proclamation. start out with saying I'm, I'm really uh, glad we're doing this proclamation and I'll share a little bit about it. Um, one of the things uh, I, I hold very dearly to my heart is that my mother, who I lost in February, had uh, been actively seeking her recovery and was doing really good. Um, um, unfortunately, COVID, you know, um, took her, but at the same time, my blessing, um, and I'm sure other people have these blessings as well, is to see your family recover. I have a lot of other family members and friends who are going through recovery, so this is so important, and I'm glad we're doing this. So I'll go ahead and uh, read this proclamation. Whereas, well, proclamation designating the month of September 2022 as National Recovery Month in Lake County. And it's whereas Recovery Month recognizes the strong and proud recovery community and the dedication of service providers and community members in Lake County who assist and support individuals from prevention services to recovery. Whereas the Lake County Behavioral Health Services provided substance use order, the disorder services to 179 participants. Hilltop Recovery Services provided 195 residential treatment beds and 52 outpatient services. Redwood Community Services, Thule House provided residential treatment services to 46 women and 26 children. Healthy Opportunities for Mothering Experiences Home, Hilltop Recovery serv or, yeah, Services and Franz House Sober Living Environment, SLE, provided combined safe housing to 34 men and women and 19 children in the calendar year 2021. And whereas, Lake County Behavioral Health Services provided mental health services to 1,229 individuals during the calendar year 2021. And whereas, nationally, 21 million people in the U.S. experience a substance use disorder, while 9.5 million experience both substance use disorder and mental health disorders. And whereas through promotion of Recovery Month, people from all walks of life are encouraged to become knowledgeable about what they can do to create a healthier tomorrow for themselves and others by helping to prevent these problems today. Whereas recovery is possible and treatment is effective, people in recovery can, can and do become gainfully employed, own homes, and rejoin their families and their communities. The challenge is to bring that treatment to all who need it and there are many such people in our community. Whereas the County of Lake Board of Supervisors and Lake County Behavioral Health Substance, Abuse, Substance Use Disorder Services, Mental Health Services, Hilltop Recovery Services, Redwood Community Services, Safe Rx, Hope Rising and Lake County Health Services urges all citizens, families, governmental agencies, public and private institutions, business, healthcare, education systems in Lake County to support efforts that will increase community awareness, understanding and action to address substance use disorder and mental health conditions in our community. Now, therefore, be it wholeheartedly proclaimed that the Board of Supervisors of Lake County joins the Lake County Department of Behavioral Health Services to hereby proclaim that September 2022 is National Recovery Month in the Lake County, in the County of Lake, sorry, passed and adopted this 13th day of September 2022. And so. So uh, thank you, Chairman. Uh, April Gambert, Lake County Behavioral Health Services. I am the newly um, promoted Deputy Director of Substance Use Disorder Services and Mental Health Services. So um, I have a renewed dedication to serving our community in the capacity of increasing overall health and wellness. And I thank the Chairman and the Board uh, for recognizing uh, this month as a recovery month. But I would also like to say that in our proclamation, it did not call out all of our providers. And unfortunately, that would list would be quite long, but I would like to take an opportunity at this moment to just say thank you to Tribal Health and other community partners who have recently um, worked very closely with our department, very closely. We are increasing collaboration, which as all of us know, is essential in providing whole person care. And so my only hope is that moving forward, we can continue to grow and strengthen ourselves. So 
we have, for the first time in a few years, a larger turnout than normal. So I'm not gonna continue to go on. I'm gonna pass this over to Amber Westfall, our Substance Use Program Manager. Hi, thank you everybody. Um, I wrote down a few words. I wanted to make sure that um, I was able to get my message across. I get a little nervous speaking in front of people, so sometimes I just have to put my thoughts on paper. So um, thank you to the board. Thank you, Supervisor Crandall, for recognizing this month as National Recovery Month. I just wanna say that, like, as April pointed out, Lake County Behavioral Health is only one piece of the recovery community. We have so many different pieces, different communities that uh, provide support and recovery. Um, I just wanna say millions of people experience substance use disorders and other behavioral health conditions daily. Many of us, Many of us um, are close to someone, if not experiencing ourselves. Um, someone working, um, we are close to someone, if not experiencing ourselves, someone working to overcome addictions. And honoring all on the road to recovery, we highlight this month and remain committed to preventing substance use disorders, supporting those who are still struggling and providing resources needed so we can all live full and healthy lives. When we help others recover, our community gets stronger and more resilient. For rural, underserved, and tribal communities, obstacles for treatment and recovery are amplified. Let us consider the work that we still need to do and let's consider the importance of changing our conversations and eliminating stig stigma associated with addiction and those who are in recovery. Overcoming substance use disorder and other behavioral health conditions is already hard as it is. Let us remember there is no wrong way to recover or to access services. This recovery month and every day, I want to thank our peer support specialists who work in the community, all these self-help groups that work and help those in recovery, our prevention specialists who work towards um, preventing substance use disorders from occurring, all of our counselors, our healthcare professionals, our MAP providers, all of our treatment providers and organizations in the community our culturally focused supports, our faith-based supports, our first responders, and our law enforcement and judicial partners. Everybody has a part, whether you feel that you're recognized or not. We all have, we're, we're all a piece to the puzzle of the recovery community, and I wanna make sure to thank everybody. You are recognized and you are honored, and thanks for all that you do. Would anybody else like to say a few words? All right. Hi, uh, my name is Jennifer Ray. I work at the Scotts Valley Band of Poe Indians SLE that we have here in Lake County. Um, I just want to say uh, we have in our community people stepping up and getting recovery and yeah, I'm kind of nervous too. <laughs> um, that's all I have. Thank you. I, they don't this is the first time I've met or been around these ladies, so um, they've sent out invitations for me to come, and um, I just came today, and I this is kind of unexpected. <laughs> We're glad you came. <laughs> Thank you, Jennifer. Yep. Hi, my name is Lori McAllen. I represent Lake County Tribal Health. And I just want to recognize all the support that we are given and working with Lake County has been um, warming. So thank you. You want me to announce the event for you? <laughs> and so the uh, recovery happens. September is National Recovery Month, and this is going to take place on September 24th, 2022 at 11 a.m. 11 Austin Park, Clear Lake, California. And so is there anything else I should add? There's a website on this form. And uh, is there somewhere? So we could just post this on the website or something like that. So, okay. So September 24th, be there, 11 a.m.
No? Oh. All right. Uh, Sam's going to make us take a picture here, so.